Hey friends, it's Jenny, and I want to share with you the layouts that I made with the Scrapbooking Fanatics November Inspire Box. Now the November Inspire Box contained items from the Evergreen Season Collection from 49 and Market. Now I had the chipboard set, the chipboard words, the wishing bubbles and baubles, you see here I've got a whole bunch of scraps left. I did have the washi tape sheets. I used some of this. And I have just a couple of pieces of paper left. So I have, this has been cut into, this is just the wood slices. The other side is this really pretty black and white, or maybe a dark gray and white uh, leaves. This is a great paper, fa la 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 la. Just that nice teal in the white background. And this side is, this is paper is called Father Christmas. So it's got the nice Santa over here and this little image of carolers and little, you know, look at the Santa here with the sleigh. And then cheerful Christmas star paper with the nice, this is a grayish background with the different images with the flowers. And I love this greenish sweater pattern. So that's what I have left of the kit that was sent to me to uh, create some layouts with. So let me show you what I made. Now this first layout is I used um, one of the solids that were included with the collection and I did tear the sides of one of the papers. This had a red and white sweater on the background to get those images of the florals. This is a picture of, that's me, my sister, and my brother from a very long time ago. You'll see on here that I did use, you know, I've got word plates and a snowflake and I've got Santa title. I also have on here, if you look up here and down here, a little bit here, here. I used a stamp that I have from All In Create. Uh, da, 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 da. That it's just from my own inventory that I wanted to go ahead and include because I bought these stamps, I need to use them. I know we're all familiar with that type of thing. I can't find it right now, but it should be right here. Huh, well, there you go. That's okay. I really want to show you the, the layout. Back behind the photo, I've got some more of this paper, just kind of like layered in the back, torn strips. I've got, um, these are from the washi stickers. We've got down here more of the baubles and things and just more of the chipboard. And this is more of the washi stickers, the nice poinsettias layered under here. But this is the first layout that I made with the kit. Very old photo of my brother, sister, and I. Now I do have, after this, I do have another brother and another sister, but they just weren't here yet. <laughs> this second layout I made, again, I used one of those background papers. Um, I used this black side. And I cut out from other papers, I cut out this piece of the, the Santa, and I layered another piece back here. I bordered my photo with a couple of pieces of paper and I've got from my own stash I put some thread back here more of those I took the washi and I put it on cardstock and I fussy cut it out I've got some border strips that I included over here and just more of the you know all of the great shipboard that was included in the kit along with these baubles and such now I did use some white acrylic paint, spattered it around here. This is from, and I'm thinking it's, I don't have much left in here. This is from, I can't even tell you, I can't read it. But it's just white acrylic. Any white acrylic paint that you have, you can just smash it around. <laughs> These are old photos of my two little ones. That's Elizabeth and George. 
and around Christmas time we have all of these little figurines that we put out so we've got you know moose and Santa Santa and mrs. Claus we've got some snowmen and they were just lining them all up and playing it was just captured a cute moment so I used a lot of the little words you know little elves because they are my little elves best ever Mary and bright and oh, you can tell there's one laying on the floor here I don't remember who that is but <laughs> They just loved playing with them, and they were just decorations that we used to put around the house. And lastly, I took another border paper, but I did cut the uh, inside out of this one. And I made a tree. All this was a full piece of paper, but anything that I used here, this is where I got, where I cut that, um, the wood slice paper to make the, the stem of my tree. And then I use just strips of paper throughout here to make my branches. Now in the kit, there were these, um, they're kind of like acrylic or plastic little teardrops. I use them all as decorations on my tree. There was also this ribbon. It's kind of like a, it's almost like a velvet sparkly. It was, it was so nice to use. So I use it here and down here and then really just sprinkled little uh, things from the packet on the from the what was included in the kit so we've got our Santa and a nice star the star is actually a piece of paper that I cut to make and I just wanted a sprinkling of the different papers that were in the collection this is a picture of our tree from many many years ago actually it's, it's a way long ago because we had carpet and I don't even, I don't have those curtains anymore. <laughs> the room's a different color, but anyway, <laughs> this from many, many years ago, but I love our tree at Christmas time. I like to take pictures and it. it's honest to goodness, we have even more stuff on it now. I just like the stuff. Go to craft fairs and things like that. And I've got ornaments that were my grandmother's and my mom's and things like that. And that's just what I like to put on my tree. I put a tag over here, more of the baubles and such and a tree here, and I use the title of Christmas. So these are the things that I made with the November Scrapbooking Fanatics Inspire Box. Now, if you subscribe to the Inspire Box, you will receive the instructions and how to create all of these layouts. Um, if you have any questions, please feel free to ask. I'm happy to help as I can. But the Inspire Box is exactly what it is. It's to inspire you. It gives you something different every month to play along with and, you know, just, it is exactly what it is. It's, it's to inspire you to play and use the things, you know, that, that are included in the box to capture some moments and memories. So I hope you like them. I, I enjoyed working with this kit very, very much. And come on, anytime you can work with 49 and market, you feel like you're, you're bougie, that's for sure. But anyway, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much for spending your time with me. I do appreciate it. God bless, and I'll see you in the next one.